This is a bad choice. This is a bad choice. Um. Um. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my extra god. Okay, we've got a problem. We've got a big problem. G'day guys, my name's Josh, you can call me Joe Wordle, and welcome back to Demolishers Only in 7 Days, where today is a very exciting day. It's not new issue day, so I'm not going to clean my goldfish tank, it is new weapon day. I spent all night last night making myself some new weapons, some new spears. G'day little dearie, how you doing in there? I'm not going to eat you for breakfast, going to have a cheeky cup of coffee instead. Looking at the sunrise, bloody gorgeous, but look at this. Look at this right off the bats. I've got all this stuff right of the rock and roll, including a, bla a, a brand new even, so it's time to come and talk, a brand new lever action rifle. Oh, I'm fizzy about it. I did make myself the only scope that I have the schematic to make, a two-time scope. Still not soaked about it, I'd much rather the reflex sight mod, so I have those peripheral visions, but I don't have that option right now, so I do have the two times in Yugo, Yugo, and Yugo. That should be good, I think. Let's have a look at you. Let's have a bit of a gander at you. Whack you in. Yeah, how good's that gonna be? It's so There's so much dark screen on the sides when you zoom in a little bit, but I just need... I'm not firing from a long way away. I just need that little bit of extra help aiming. So if I do want to hit some nips, I have that chance. You can now go, uh, modify you, get rid of that one. Thank you both for your wonderful service, but it's time for an upgrade. So you were doing 18 and 30 with a cost of uh, well, 18 compared to much more with a, not nearly as bad as the summoner cost used to be, but with the Ergo Grip mod, back to basically the same. So that's actually pretty bloody Rigi Dig. I'll take you out, chuck you in the bleeding mod, chuck you onto there and put... I don't really have where to put you right now, do I? I don't I don't think I'm going to chuck you into that one instead. Get rid of you and chuck on that one. It's the best I can possibly do. What about the rifle though? 91 compared to 55 I was doing before. Oh, what a day. I tell you, if that doesn't get you excited, I don't think anything will. I'll change over the AK for the lever action. Is that deer still cruising about? Ooh. Get a hot stuff. Is that deer still cruising around somewhere out here? Because now that I have the bit of rifle, I want to break it in. However, it's all looking pretty scant out here at the moment. Oh. Oh. Those aren't deers. Those are zombie dogs. All right. Well, what better way to break it in then? Gone. Gone. Oh, my goodness. Oh, I, I gave it some bullet drop I really didn't need to. That's not how this game works. That one's gone. That is some delectable shooting. Five shots, four kills. Only missed one because I'm a galah. What a day. What an upgrade this is. And another bag as well. Got a treasure map out of the first one of the tier two mining helmet with the mod included. I might actually go and harvest up those doggos in a moment because, well, I mean, they're made out of bones and bones gives me sticky stuff. I spent all my sticky stuff making weapons and things. Another harvesting tool. Thank you. Make quality four stone tools. I'll just scrap you immediately. Eat you. Take the rest. Was there another? There was another bag. Another bag in the bushes. Every morning you come outside to have a look at the glinting sun. And it's like Santa Claus is being here. Because there's presents everywhere for me. It's beautiful. Uh-oh. There was one left alive. One left alive. Oh, don't aim down the sides. That's why. That's why I don't like it so much. It was a good bloody pill though. Save my own life. That's the thing. Like when, you, when you're in a panicked moment like that and you got to try and find the target, aiming down the sides blinds you so much that I hate it so much. I need to go and get those mods. There are mods that removes. I mean, it's a bit more of an involved process than just like changing the overlay. But there are definitely mods that reskin the guns to give you peripheral vision back. Just should be vanilla though. It should really be vanilla. That like the scope overlay thing, it's garbage. Chuck all this stuff away. In fact, it's probably about time I went and did a bit of selling. What's the day today? Day nine. So tomorrow's trade restock day. What do you got for me, Nicole? What do you got for me? Where are you going to send me to? To whom it may concern? It definitely concerns me. Where? Where you want me to go? Ooh, not so bad, actually. If I can go past... That's actually a pretty good shot. I can go past the old ranger station where I left the loot that time. Follow the path around. Dig you up. Maybe you can use some demos to go digging. Like, I've tamed them again. Look at that. Look at the wreckage around here. That was such a bad horde night. That was such, such a bad horde night. I've been living with the consequences of that for ages. Trade is actually open at the moment. So I might quickly duck on in and see if I can get a quest out towards where Nicole... I hate that so 
I, I want to get rid of it, but I need the extra damage that the scope's giving me. I don't have that many rifle mods at the moment, so I'm going to keep it anyway. But see if I can grab a job out towards where I'm headed. We're into the tier 2s now. But it's here, so it's, that's to the west. That's kind of where I'm going. Well, that's a fetch and clear. Also to the west. It's exactly on the way. Exactly what I was hoping for. Cheese knackers, you heard my inner dreaming and you, you made it come true. What a lad. Old man Huzzy Buzzy making dreams come true. I didn't have to wish on a star or anything. Just wish on his beard. Gave it a tickle and he gave it what I want. Oh, oh, hang on. Hang on. I mean, I've broken my rifle with the doggos, but... I want to break it in. <laughs> That's enough to make a heart grow three sizes. Like I'm the bloody Grinch. Look at the sit down. The stopping power. Boom. Sit down again. What don't you? Three rounds. Three rounds to the face and the demo's gone. Oh my goodness, that changes everything. It's gone from being like 15 rounds in a slow reload to three rounds in quick succession without any reload. Oh my goodness. I'm gonna have to, I'm mean, like I'm sitting down already because I would have had to otherwise just to really bask in the glory of that. Shit, yes. I was so excited about that. I completely forgot I was supposed to be doing the quest and rode directly past it. Just gonna quickly check the cars before I reset it. Yes, I know it's double dipping, but call me Costanza in a way. I'm gonna dip, take a bite and dip the chip again. Anything in you, I've already been here. All right, well, with my new high-powered rifle, let's uh, let's give it a whirl. You changed into a minivan, sold his ute, and picked up a people mover. Old mates had some kids. Nothing in you. I think I'm supposed to start at this bar. We'll get in there in a moment. Make sure I'm leaving absolutely nothing behind. Any cheeky books in you, please? Ooh, yes, there is. Thank you. I'm no longer pining for them like I once was. I still appreciate it. Actually, come to think of it, as I quickly check... The outhouse out the back. Uh, what's it gonna take to make a cement mixer? 30. 30 workstation books. So I do wanna start putting some points into minus 69 um to get bet oh to get better tools, but I think oh! Ah! <laughs> get absolutely robbed to stop like a muppet without a hand inside it. You've got absolutely soggy. Sat. One more. No, nope, missed the shot. Sats. Oh my god, that is satisfying. The game has changed. The game is changed, and I'm now the biggest dick in the land. You're all at my beck and call now. Get absolutely sat the lot of yous. I've been so excited about the rifle, and boy, howdy, am I excited about the rifle. I haven't even checked what my spear is capable of doing these days. Cheeky gun safe in the cupboard. Any. Still no suit jackets. In fact, he might be... Shit! G'day, buddy. Can I... Hang on. I shouldn't be going pa power attacks. I'm stopping from breaking the door, though. I was for a moment. Get you sat down. Oh, my goodness. I don't have the book yet to penetrate multiple targets. This is a completely different game. This is a completely different game. I'm no longer... Oh! Running for my life from every confrontation. It's still him sometimes, though. Let's be real. Oh, he ducked it. Hup! Missed the jump. Missed the jump, but I didn't die. Hang on, buddy. Just... <laughs> oh, you're in my house now. You guys ain't got nothing. You got nothing. You got bloody nothing. Let's quickly check the rest of this floor to make sure that there's no one else around. Some more murkies. Thank you. And a fair amount of medical supplies as well. That's actually a pretty good get. More than I was anticipating. Always check the garbage. I learned that from Samara. Open you. Still no big boy jackets. Where was the safe? Honestly, I'm I'm about as about as happy as a dog with two dicks right now. I I'm blown away. The demos are blown away. I'm blown away at how much better the hunting uh, the lever action is. I know I skipped the hunting rifle entirely purely because I just couldn't make one. Nor the spear. Uh, I didn't have the workbench, but it's chalk and cheese. It's not even. Not even the same category of weapon, the pipe rifle to the lever action. I'm having such a bloody good time. Thank you. I'll take you, chuck some mods in you and sell you. have got plenty of mods back home. Oh, what a day. What? It's not even, it's barely even 9 a.m. and I'm having a peach of a time. I've woken up one. That's all right. Come up the stairs, please. I think I'm working. <sighs> I think I've woken a second one. 
Not that it matters. I'm going to stack it like cordwood at the bottom of the bleeding stairs. Is this what it feels like to be God? When Zeus was rolling around impregnating a bunch of mortals and making demigods, is this how he bloody felt? Because I tell you, it feels fucking fantastic. I can see a glowy nip through the wall of it, through the little gap, but I'm no peeping Tom, so... Go for the face instead. I didn't... It's not even a bulletproof tarp. It's a bulletproof wall in front of it. Oh, there's one much closer. I've got three rounds left in the mag. Oh, I almost volleyed him. That was probably a little bit keen of me. I'm going to close that door real fast and get a better angle. Let's pick up that chest. They can come nice and straight. Right down the runway for me. Beautiful. Look at you all. Look at you all. You're not too sexy for the catwalk. You're perfectly fine for my gun. This feels fucking fantastic. After being petrified for just over a week and after all that the Horde Knight was, finally having the upper hand on this just feels amazing. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to smile for a week after this. There's the satchel just under the stairs down in the loot room. Beautiful. I'm pretty chockers on loot at the moment, though. I'm definitely going to get way down by the end of this, but that's all right. Nothing fun in you at all. Checked everything else. It's just the main loot room left to go. Leather chunky boy with... Five more food and loot, a tier six pistol, a water purifier mod. Not too bad, actually. I'll whack you in, because why not? I'll also chuck that into there. Keep my, there you go. Keep my, my pockets nice and full. Anything else around? A couple bits of glue. All right. A tier one crossbow. I'm not usually huge on the old crossbows. I'm going to go make myself a whole bunch of, um of bolts for it. In fact, I'll change it over later, but you can take a scope as well. Very interesting. And you're definitely going to be better, much better than what, uh, what I'm rolling with, with the primitive bow. In fact, there's some right there. There's some right bloody there. I'm going to go, going to scrap you, chuck you to there. Going to scrap you too. I'm going to whack you with a brand new iron crossbow bolt. <laughs> Not that I super need you. I feel like the rifle's got you pegged anyway. Oh, it's raining outside and the soundtrack is gorgeous. It's giving me flashbacks to when I was sleeping under a tin roof. I'll tell you what, the rainstorms on that will put you to sleep in about four seconds. Can I just get like a, like a deck chair? Just sit out here, watch the rain out the window like I'm living in Fraser's apartment. Ah, well, now I've got to keep on moving. got to keep on going. Where did I leave my bike before? What a raid that was. After struggling so hard for so long, rolling into there and rinsing the joints. That's a level of satisfaction I don't think I was ready for. My knees are going over that. Here's the circle. So I'll just chuck my bike down somewhere. There is a couple of demos around. I'm not particularly concerned about them though. If I come over and say, hey, I've got something ready for them. Uh, well, I actually chuck some things in my bike actually, so I'm not way down. You just hold on to whatever. In fact, the things... I want to put it in the things that don't stack. Uh, you, I'm not going to find out you. You don't stack, you don't stack. I'm not going to find more of you, I don't think, either. It'll do. All right. Well, ready or not, here I come, Nicole. I'm coming to find your cheeky buried treasure. Where is it? Give it to me fast. I've been digging so long down here that the rainstorm has passed, but I'm still very much soggy. Is the circle's still going this way is a little bit i've already gone all the way out to the east out there so i'm checking underneath the ramp that i came in on i feel like half the time oh circle's coming in again it's definitely pushed me this way i feel like half the time i go digging the boxes underneath where i start my my entry ramp goes away from it and it hides underneath but that's all right just follow the circle we'll find it eventually we'll keep going this way okay we'll i need to make sure i check everywhere no that was the wrong way the circles pushed me back Back underneath my entry ramp. All right. <laughs> I should have stayed with it. It's like that meme with the guy who's like six inches away from finding a big bunch of diamonds and... You son of a... <laughs> what did I tell you? It's like directly underneath the first block I broke. I swear there's some sort of code there. It's like the first block you break, it spawns directly underneath it because it always knows we're going a different direction. I don't have a whole lot of, uh, of lock picks on me. I should have thought that before I came out here though. That's fine. Just have faith. Have hope. If it gets really bad, use a demo to pop it. But oh, that's bloody risky. Come on, please. 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 Yes. Oh, thank God. Oh, I've been pretty upset, but we're all good. $11,000 redos. Fucking cheese, Nicole. What a lass you are. Before I leave, there's a demo like just next to where I left my bike. So three and a half times damage is not an awful lot, is it? That's the thing. Like what? 
It's like two shots with the rifle if I get the stealth damage on the first one. And then you're taking so much more to finish. I'll take my bolts back. And finish off with the spear instead. Oh, I'm, I'm a walking arsenal of demo nightmares. You're all in trouble. Did I ever get this ATM that's here? It's still marked on the map. I did not. I've only got the one lockpick. I'll gamble on it. But Lee, I feel better using a, uh, a demo to break an ATM than the buried supplies, uh, the buried treasure. That would have been real bloody risky if it broke the block below. It would have lost everything. But if a lockpick snaps, which is going to be funny because now that I'm kind of anticipating it snapping, of course it fucking doesn't. Never mind, lad. You're all good. You can't. He saw it. He saw me actually get through into it. He's like, all right, fine. Didn't want to come help anyway. See you later. Another thousand dollar redos. I think I left some gubbins. Ooh, I might have left some gubbins, but then I reset the POI. And then everything exploded. All right, yeah, that's fine. That's fine. I'm going to get rid of you. Get rid of you. Nice. A little, little piss up on the way to make a thousand bucks. It's like an electrician. Sparky money out here. Oh, no, there was some stuff left over, but it was all in the box out the front. I remember now. I will move to the out here when I needed to. I'm a little peckish. So I'll eat you. I'd like to take as much with the as possible from this. I can't really do that. Okay. There's a lot of ammo in there. I do want to go and sell some stuff and the scrap armor bottles will be worth a bit. Probably break you reasonably high level. I'll scrap you for the lead. I don't need you. Scrap you for the iron. I can make some more if I need to. We don't need the blood bags. Might as well leave you in there. Scrap that for the lead as well. And a couple of cheeky pipe bombs. Yucca seed, mushrooms come with me. Vegemite sangers, stay behind. You come, you come, you come, and you come. Like Duke, you come. Take all of that. That'll, that'll do nicely. Actually, that's, that's everything I kind of needed except for you, which can go there. Beautiful. Had to come home and drop everything off before I go and see the trader. Yes, look, I've got all these mods here that can go into you. Because you're a T6, you're not really worth much at the moment, but each mod I put into you is going to be worth so much more money. You just need that to repair, I'm pretty sure. And then you can take both of those that are kind of doing nothing for me at the moment. Modify you. 500 bucks, probably $1,000 for some T6 knuckle wraps. That's why I get so, so bleeding excited that every time I uh, find a T6 anything, is there anything else I can chuck in you? Weighted head. Beautiful. In you go. 1,500 smackers for a couple of strips of leather. That is some math and I enjoy. <laughs> I don't really like math at the best of times. Just going to quickly chuck up. Oh, actually, I want another two. Double of armor pocket mod because I'm actually wearing some armor for a change. That scrap armor bundle gave me some chest covers and some thigh covers. And I realized that I'm wearing nothing at the moment, which normally I'm not so worried about because heavy armor slows you down. But I've already got... My heavy helmet, I'm kind of going into heavy armor more and more, so may as well just free up some more inventory space by wearing any sort of coverings. You've got that. Plus, I can chuck the bandolier mod on, which is always a good idea. You can have that one. Beautiful. Look at all the extra carrying space. All right, it's what? Ugh, it's getting pretty late in the day, but we're okay. I can go back to Trady, potentially do another cheeky quick job for him. Wouldn't even say no to that. Some extra rewards, some extra pats on the back. Affirmation is really all I ever want. Need to check his vetting machine first in case he's got some sugar butts for tomorrow. You do not. You never bloody do. Might have to go and pedal around town and see if I can find not some. Bad, Trading through iron boots. Ooh, great. a better fire axe. Go to your head. Like, yeah, the dubs is tempting, but I'm pretty well kitted for offensive weapons at the moment, so I'll take the axe instead. Thank you. You've got that. <gasps> Put your money where your mouth is, Wordle. Put your fucking money where your big flapping gob is. You've been spruiking how bloody fantastic everything is since you got the rifle. Well, time to go see. Time to go see if it's actually going to save you from a demo infestation. What could go wrong? What could go wrong with this? I'm sure it'll be fine. All of my nice, warm, fuzzy feelings are gone. Uh, are completely gone. Despite feeling like I was on top of the world four seconds ago... A demo infestation? That's that's bad news whichever way you want to shake it. You could tip it upside down and spank it like a sauce bottle. It's still looking real come a cropper. You can go there. You can go there. I don't think I need the rest of it. I might grab a cheeky coffee because it might be my last one. Oh, oh. <laughs> oh the game heard me. The game heard me. The game heard me being confident and decided to slap me down instead. 
I don't, I don't feel good about this. It's all the bloody way across town, but I'm taking, oh, taking opportunity to see if I can find any vendos or some newspaper stands. Already read that one. I need one more book for Spears. Not that one. And I'll have finished, damn it, finished the series. Any others? Any any's? No any's. No any's at all. All right. Ooh, I take it back. There is, there is some any's. Hold on. Right. There, fuck, that was a good shot by you. See what I mean? See what I mean? I'm feeling too confident. I'm feeling really good about myself, which is when the game comes into its own. Three rounds into you. You're done. That was some clinical business. Clinical business on the demos. Check you. Should have sold that book, but it's all right. Another four-day handbook. We're edging ever closer towards our cement mixer. Ooh, who doesn't love a bit of edging? Couple more demos coming to interrupt my newspaper time. Oh, there. Put you up. I'd, I'd, I'd love to get the double tap volley. If I could get it. Oh, thank you. If I get a, a double headshot, like sit him on the first and then catch him with the second on the fly, you're not dead yet. That'd be a really good bloody day. Put you down. Another rifles book. Thank you. Some more titty covers. Now I can finally read my morning paper. Nothing in you. Nothing in you. And nothing in you. Fine. Guess I can't have everything. It's, it's weird not feeling scared of the demos. I need to be less cocky though. I'm going to an infestation and the game's going to clap me. There's a book house just there. And as much as I'd love to go and have a squeeze through that, I'm on a mission. If once more life, I'm staying focused on that. Oh, it's a big wood house. It's a big wooden house and wooden things burn pretty easily. Unfortunately, I'm dealing with napalm demos now. Oh, God. Go on, catch your bloody later. Post and Pat's been and dropped us some magazines for me as well. It's good. It's really bloody good. I'm gonna park up my bike like a responsible person right up in the driveway. Give you a tickle and say good day to whoever's waiting for me. Rise and shine, everyone. Me and my big gun's here to see ya. I'm gonna try my absolute best to do. Oh! Oh, no! No! Oh, that hurts so much! <laughs> I was just about to say I'm going to try my absolute best to do this properly and not completely bit it. And what did I do? I burned the fucking house down. Because of course I did. Because of course I did. All that... Whatever. Whatever. What are you going to do? Burn the house down again? Cool. Enjoy that one. All that bloody big cock shambling I was doing has led to this. I need to get the loot. I need to get the loot before the building comes down. Excuse me. I need to get inside. That's the wrong block. Whatever. Go with it. I need to get inside nice and fast. Come on. Stand on now's at the time. This seems like a great time to have a beer. I definitely feel like I've earned that one. Uh oh. Here comes the flames. Here comes the flames. Get in there fast. Um, although that was my last piece of fluids. So if I put myself out, if I catch on fire, I'm going to be absolutely dick cheesed. Went the double up. Didn't work. Gonna have to go with the spear. Oh, this, this, is, this is a bad idea. This is a bad idea. Excuse me, excuse me, excuse me, excuse me, excuse me. My stamina is absolutely cooked. Come on, beer. Beer, you're supposed to be helping me. Oh, there's flames in the exit now. Uh, AK. There goes one. Hang on. Up over the balcony. Oh, yep. <laughs> the building's burning down around us, boys. You should probably leave. That would be the smarter idea for all of us, but I'm committed to loot. You can get out of my way. I got them all gone. We're all good. The fire's still spreading. I'm going to take you. None of you count as putting out flames. Is there any fluids anywhere in here? You're not fluids. You're the opposite of that. Neither are you. You guys are all currently burning. I can't believe I burned the freaking house down. <sighs> um... All right, that's completely gone that way. I'd even go to some murky water if I really bloody needed it. Oh, that's getting worse. That's getting much, much worse. It was a fetch and clear, wasn't it, I think? No, it was just an infestation. A fetch and clear was the last one. You're not hiding anything. Make sure my guns are reloaded before I go into the next room. Great, so I'm trapped by fire in a d infested demolisher building. Love that for me. This might just be my saving grace actually going down into the basement. Oh, bar not now. That's a good shot from the hip. Better shot from the scope. That's why I wanted the two times, not the bigger times. Scrap you, take the rests. 
I can go to the, uh, I can go to the basement. But there's still some stuff up in the ceiling. Just double check. It's the loot. It's the main loot. I need to get you fast. I need to get you fast before you burn down. Take you. Bookstore box. Take that one. Take that one. Sure. Ammo. Go faster. Uh, yeah, that short. Whatever happened with anything. Oh, things are breaking down around me as well. Take all of that. Uh, food pile. I can't see the flames yet. So out of, out of sight, out of mind. Or whatever. Bonds may got two skill points to go. I need my wrench. Wrench. You. You. Infestation cash with... Scrap you, scrap you, take that, and... No, I think I think we're pretty much fine on most of that one. Oh, I was meant to break down the infestation cache. All right, we're fine. We're good. Working stiff box, though. Read that. Cheeky extra anvil. Get out. Get out before the building... Oh, before the building burns down around you. Get out, knackers. This is a bad choice. This is a bad choice. Um. Um. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, my extra god. Okay, we've got a problem. We've got a big problem. I've got five rounds in the chamber. One. Don't take shots unless you're sure you're going to hit it because otherwise... Shit! We're just going to die. Take the chance to reload. Oh, I'm running into fire though. My frame rate is absolutely cooked. I think it's just you two left over. That was the last one. No time to reload. No time to reload. Are you gone? You got... Oh, damn it. Didn't quite squeeze through. Okay, job done. Get to the basement where you're not going to get set on fire. And the building's going to come down around you. This was a bad plan. This is a bad plan. I had to get the loot. I had to finish the job. But now what the fuck are we going to do? Just get down low and go, go, go. The whole ceiling is on fire on top of me. That's the way out. That's the way out. It's mildly on fire. By mildly, I mean quite a lot on fire. Is there anything I can do to get out of here? I can scrap you to free my inventory space and eat you for some health regeneration. I've got one... Oh my god. I've got one thing of fluids. Go before the stairs go. Go before the stairs go. Ow. Ow. Yes, I know. Yes, I know. Freedom. Oh, the building's coming down around us. I put myself out by drinking my water, murky water even. I didn't get uh, food poisoning. That's about as much of a win as possible. All of my skin has been melted off. Look what I've done. Look what I did to this place. I'm just gonna... <coughs> I'm just gonna leave. Uh, yeah. No, nah, we're fine. We're all good. It was, um, it was like that when I got here. I don't think I have many nerve endings left, but what I do have is getting cooled off by the rain. Thank you. Only hurt a lot, but thank God. Thank God I found that one murky water in the toilet downstairs where I was, I was absolutely pancaked. Pull up here. Grab you. Check for another spear book. There's a mansion just here. There's some nice houses around here. I mean, I like mine better, but it's always nice to check on your neighbors. It's like when your neighbor's selling a house and having an open inspection. You just go have a look. Not because you want to buy, just because you want to have a little snoop around. I don't think I'm going to make it back to tradies in time. I've got not much time left on the clock and I'm still a few hundred meters away. But did you notice when I came out of the burning building how many demos were milling around outside? I'm a dollars to donuts. That... What? Yeah, dollars to donuts. That was, a, uh, that was a scout horde. That was a screamer in the guise of a demo that had shown up and called them in. But because they no longer look like a screamer, they don't have the scream, they just kind of like trigger that mechanic and all of the demos in the world show up and that is not good. But I managed to get away with it some way, somehow. Pull you around, close the door behind us, grab whatever I... Whatever I can out of you. Did I get everything? It kind of glitched there for a moment, but I think I got everything. I'm not entirely too sure. I might have been stitched up on that. It's actually not too bad, though, because I do have to go and see Trady in the morning. I think you're better than what I'm currently wearing. You aren't, but you have more mod slots. But you also can't take that one. I'm going to leave my leathers on for the moment. You can go, go in there. Batten parts. And the good thing about you is you can be sold. You can go back to that one. Sell you. Drink that. Can I sell the anvil? 50 bucks. Ah, uh, might as well hold on to you for later then, just in case. Chuck you into them. Got 10 grand on me. So I didn't manage... Oh, I can sell you guys as well. Never going to use shotguns. So I can um, hopefully find some sugar butts in the morning. Oh, my frame rate is ass. That building burning down the other side of town is not good. All the way down there, I think it was. Yeah, look at it. Look at the bomb site, literally, that it is now. 
I didn't mean it. I didn't mean for it to go that way. It just kind of did. I think at this point, I'm pretty happy just to ditch the bow and the, oh, the crossbow and stuff. Like, am I really actually going to be using that? Not especially. Chuck you guys into them. And then I can move all of my weapons up a slot and run with my wrench on my hot bar. Look, that frees up like three extra spaces. That's definitely the right call. I mean, and given I'm rolling in and blasting everyone away with my rifle anyway, if I can I get a suppressor? I cannot. I'd love to get one. Maybe trade it with someone in the morning. But I think tomorrow, like the first thing I'm going to do is go and chat to old matey Trady Potato and hand him my quest. But then there's the opening trade that's down there. It's a brand new tradey day. So if I head through you, pedal my little took us all the way down to you and see what you've got as well, that might give me the most amount of benefits. Maybe even grab a quest and you might be down there as well. There's just so much to do. There's so much to do. And it doesn't really help when the first demo that I come across in the infestation, I tickle nipples and he burns the fucking building down. That is one of the more intense raids I've done in a long time. Fighting a demolisher horde in a burning building? That's... You wouldn't read about it. If you read about it, you'd be like, nah, that's definitely not a real thing. But I did that. And I came out, well, not unscathed. I melted off most of my body parts, but... I managed to stagger out, put myself out, and get home again, which is all you can ever ask. I'll have to come back and hopefully get home again in another episode because this episode is done. So thank you guys for watching. Most of all, thank you to the patrons of Patreon who made this episode possible. If you liked, make sure you hit the button, like button down below, or subscribe to this channel. Follow me on Twitter. But I'll talk to you there first. I'll see you in the next episode. Have a good one.